uh, that is either you, your own self, or uh, someone else. But it, it's quite possible it's, it's you, because it's the Queen of Swords. And in the middle, in the reverse, we have the Princess of Swords. So unless, unless you have a person around you who is very much uh, focused on um, a sort of communication, that is an air sign like Libra, Aquarius or Gemini, and is much young, younger than you, or in that matter, maybe not younger, but just behaves younger, and they in the center of the spread and they in the reverse. I have a feeling because the the, card, the ten of swords when it flew out, it was it it sort of wondered which way shall I which way shall I go. And I have a feeling you either wanted to end something, to to just end it, but you couldn't. It it didn't to me. It didn't really come in the upright. Not really. Now, um, let me let me tell you what I get uh, looking at looking at this. Uh, at the top row, the three cards that came out for you just like that. I didn't even pick them. The seven of cups and uh, the 10 of pentacles, both of them in the upright. Now, looking at the seven of cups, it always uh, sort of reminds me of uh, what could I have now or what could I have more that I don't have. Well, you obviously, or most of you in September will be quite, um, quite well, um, provided with whatever you need because you've got the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles is is not only about money it's look at look at the whole family there you have the love you have the children you have the dog and the, the old man you have it all in one card and I can see you as if you can as if you wonder in September I, I cannot pick I cannot choose there is something more that I actually want, but I just, I, I can't make my mind up about it. Now, what, I, what else I pick up, I, I have a feeling you want it, or maybe some of you, definitely some of you, probably because, look, you're, you're right here in the corner of your own spread. The younger version of you is in the middle of it, of the spread. And the middle of the spread is really the most important one. Now, for some of you, really, what I think is you are leaving that you or you want to leave. You really want to leave that young uh, perception that people have of you, that young dependent on the family and on you just you feel mature now. You want to break away. You want to, to just probably go and rent your own place or uh, go and travel or, or, do, or, or just not work for the, for the family business or something like that. You are not, you, you are not uh, young and non-experienced anymore. You come up in the upright as the queen. And it doesn't matter if you're male or you're female. You come up as the queen and you look towards the future. This is the future here. This is always the future. And if you could have a look, I'll try to move the camera, but if you could have a look, you look towards the future and the younger version of you looks towards the past. And the, that being, being, uh, you know, you wanted probably this solitude, just just that little time to yourself to to think about the matter and decide: Am I ready to leave all this behind and go my own way, do it my own way? Well, 
I think this is it uh, because the hermit is coming in the uh, in the reverse as well. You you are over that phase of thinking and considering what could I do or, or what how could I do it best. And the good thing about the ten of swords is uh, coming coming in the position it came out sort of a bit more upside down than than in a normal way is that you seem to be um, mindful of the people, maybe your own family, maybe your, who knows, your friends, your whatever, whoever this is. And you don't want to really hurt them. You don't want to hurt them to, to just leave like that. And you're trying, you, I, I think you will do it anyway because the Ten of Swords is the Ten of Swords. But you will try to do it in a much softer manner, much gentler. Right? You, you don't want to hurt them. You, you don't want to hurt that beauty here. This, this beautiful little family or this, this, those people that have been looking after you forever. That's only one option. I mean, this, this can be... Um, this is only in case you are young. Um, there are obviously other cases as well. Maybe this is a job and you want to leave, but you want to leave because you're more mature now, because you know you can do more about, you have more experience, you know better, and so far and so on. Um, and you are in September, what I see is you, you will be getting ready. Look, the two of wands, this is like putting the first pillars on for, for you to do this step and you will do it. You're putting them up and, uh, you're looking forward. And the other card that suggests that you are doing this is the three of, of pentacles. Some of you are definitely going to go for an interview, uh, for another job, for a higher position, for whatever that is, but they will have to show the skill that they have. Look, um, I'll try to show you like this. People will be watching you what you do and if this is a presentation do not worry at all because you will do it perfectly they're absolutely admiring your work and um, you seem to be a master at it whatever that is and if this is an exam this will be a successful exam as well the only thing that I that I feel about you is that you don't trust look the high priests the high the high priestess when she comes up in the reverse is like as if you don't trust your own powers you don't trust your own intuition and i can see you here as well with the seven of cups look as if you daydream a little bit and you have so many options and but in the reverse with the high priest look instead of instead of yes i can do this i can have it all in my hands i only need to to wish for it i only need to point at it basically um ways in the reverse is not happening uh in your mind that is it's only in your mind if, like you know because in real life actually if you if you see it down here and up here it is happening and your higher self not the younger version your higher self knows it you're very look look at yourselves you're very confident if you could look at your um face expression it is so confident and you know it and you you absolutely look forward the um the future um and yes as i said i mean um many of you are probably just trying um to do it in the most gentle manner so no one gets hurt uh, that way but i think your family will be supportive whatever that is and not only, but um, 
I, I, I just whatever the the cards the 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 suggestion of the cards is, trust in yourself because if you do this, you will be absolutely do this, go first for this. Uh, but basically, you should actually even start here. Put the pillars up, okay? Then go for this. You will you will know what this might be so put the put the base then go for the presentation um and then you will make the money and you can happily look towards the future just as simple as that the same the same story can be put in a, in a quite a romantic um although i don't see it here but the two of wands sometimes you know some of you might have an interest in a, in a colleague or something like that and if you want to really impress them because the happiness is here and i i just feel a, you don't as if you don't really have that that self-esteem that is needed um but they actually will admire you whatever that is they will admire you um it's it might as well po possibly be someone from from the team or uh someone from, because i can see you wanting to put something together the two of one is, is like getting two things together having put some base and looking forward to move to the next step um and I really, really do think it's either a school, if, if this is a heart matter, if this is a romantic matter, it's either going on in the school, like in the, in the university, in the school, or this is a, a job related because of the three and ten of pentacles. For some of you who uh, have been aiming for some sort of document, um, for some sort of document to be issued to them, well, you are going to get it. You are going to get it in uh, in September, definitely. Now, um, trying to figure when around September, the Ten of Pentacles is quite a big one. Um, so I suppose the Ten is the, the Pentacles are speaking still about Virgo. And Virgo time is until the 20, I don't know, 21, 22 of September. It's not in, uh, you, you will not have to wait until Libra. I don't think you will have to wait until Libra. I think you will, between 3 and 10 of September, you will probably get this document. And I was just saying to the other sign, how uh, often this card comes up on a, uh, as a document. The other day it came as a driving license in one of my uh, friends reading and uh, she could not renew it. It came up in the reverse and she came back, she couldn't renew it. So I, it, it was just a driving license. So sometimes it's a document, any type of document, but it's in the upright, you're getting it. You're absolutely getting it. Um, and the 10, 3, 10, between, if if any of you are dealing with um, any sort of that matter. But you see, this is what, this is what I see in September. You feel grown up. You feel grown up. You feel um, more like, uh, you know, you want to move on uh you you are serious you're not anymore the princess you're not the princess and it it doesn't matter if this is a female or a male card now here it's a general reading i cannot really um uh, get onto onto gender here and stuff like that so you're not the 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 spot princess anymore you're not the, you know you know exactly what I mean saying this and um, if this is if most of you are probably not that young anymore so in this case this is not anymore I don't you don't feel in your place 
like you may have started a couple of years ago at that position or maybe one year ago who wastes these days a couple of years in one position but um it's not you are not learning to uh, to uh deal with the sword in 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 your arms anymore now today look at yourself back then you were standing bare feet you were holding it uh wrapping up even you were wrapping up um uh what is it called ribbons around it well we don't really wrap up ribbons around our swords which is our words look at you now confident sitting on your position there is no more ribbons around your sword you just use your words as you should you're confident about it you can you're just doing it you're just doing it i mean whatever that is um whatever that might be in in each one of your lives and situations because it's so many out there of, of Aquarians um, it's just the fact that you are going to to climb up the ladder you will be one step higher or even a, a few steps higher and the only point is trust your intuition why trust it you're Aquarian Aquarians are great I mean, even Aquarian is, isn't intuitive, then who should be? Um, so, my dear Aquarians, I think really you are putting the base, you are going to make that step. And, and the most I like is you will try whatever move you make not to hurt other people to do it as painlessly as possible and for everyone for your colleagues for your family for your friends for your school friends uh, i don't know whoever that is for your lovers ex-lovers to be and all of that um you you just and it will hurt still a little bit because ten of swords is ten of swords but it doesn't matter at least you're trying to m make it milder and and be more um sensitive and sensible sensible towards others towards other human beings which is the best we can do eventually in particular nowadays 